Every week, the world loses an area of forest the size of London. This mass clearing of trees is known as deforestation, and it has wiped out more than half of the planet's tropical forests since the 1960s. We've lost 130 million hectares of forest in the last three decades or so. I mean, that's an incredible amount of forest destruction. Research shows 40% of deforestation globally is caused by commercial agriculture. Urbanization is another driving factor. There's really an explosion ongoing in developing countries with expansion of roads and highways and big projects such as hydroelectric dams and coal-fired power plants that are opening up a lot of the last remaining forest areas like a flayed fish. It's a serious concern because forests are vital to our survival and well-being. They help us breathe and act as a stabilising force for the climate, regulating ecosystems and protecting native species. Deforestation is one of the biggest threats to biodiversity and a major driver of the climate crisis. If you were to destroy the Amazon, you would be creating somewhere on the order of about 100 billion tons of carbon emissions. So that would be have an enormous impact on the global climate just through its effects on global warming. But there's good news. Conservation projects are happening across the globe. Brazil's Amazon Region Protected Areas program has been successful in protecting 60 million hectares of rainforests, or 15% of the Brazilian Amazon. Only time will tell if these projects are enough to offset the impact of deforestation. The Australian Academy of Science. Because questions need answers.